The cold and wet weather in Pretoria did not dampen the spirit of Mamelodi Sundown supporters and the local community to pay their last respects to the colorful former soccer official. Shakwani's family has been shattered by his sudden passing. They revealed that he had four operations done on his brain after suffering a stroke in December and never recovered. To the former and current players of the club, he remains special. Despite having to play their final match of the season late on Wednesday evening at Loftus First Felt, the entire team and technical staff couldn't miss Shakwani's funeral. We have lost a legend, we have lost a giant. And um, for us, especially players at Mamelodi Sundowns, I think it's a great loss. Uh, because he was not just Bralex to us, he was like a father to us. You know, there's uh, sometimes when the team is going through a patch, there's a word he used to to use in English. It shall be well. I think Goldfinger played a, a huge role to to, to many of us. Um, um, he, made, he made sure that when we when we arrive at Sundowns. Um, you knew that you, you belong to some, some, some family and he made sure that you're comfortable enough you know, to express yourself in that uh, department or even environment. So yeah, we knew um, that we belong somewhere and we belong to the Sun Sundance family. The multi-talented Shakwani performed various roles at the club. He served as the club's public relations officer for many years and later in his career worked as supporters coordinator. Shakwani also helped to recruit a lot of talented players to the club. Cameroon national team come here to play against four national tournament. After the game against Bafana Bafana, he's the one who come to me the first. He walk into the Tracy home and just come to me and say, hey, I want you to come and play for my team. Shakwani was one of the best scouts for Sundowns as well. I remember because I, I joined Sundowns from Bluefontein Celtics, where I had I had my best best best, best football career, and I think he's one of the guys who said to Sundowns, I, I think we need to go and sign Wire. Shakwani also touched the lives of football supporters across different teams in South Africa and beyond. His funeral attracted fans and officials from different clubs. We just like to send our condolences to the family. Uh, friends, colleagues, and uh, Mamelodi Sundowns uh, in entirety. So, indeed, we've lost a giant. That's the kind of people we want to, the people who could relate to, to the supporters, the people who could always be on the level of the supporters, the people who love the team. We are here to honor and respect a gallant fighter, a legend, uh, the men who make football entertaining to us, the fans. Alex Chakwani, he was not only Sundowns. Alex Chakwani is the only person that made uh, the players realize the importance of fans, of which even to us it brought a, a huge impact because football is an emotional sport. Then there was drama midway through the funeral service. Former Chief's Public Relations Officer Louis Chakwani was arrested midway through the service after making his speech. Chakwani, who has been on the run for four years, was apprehended by members of the Hawks at the International Assemblies of God Church in Mamelodi. The former football official was arrested for his alleged involvement with the running of a multi-million rand investment scheme which affected scores of people in 2019. Sfiso Ramara, SABC News, Mamelodi in Pretoria.